All right, so sometimes when people find out I study snails, they ask me, well, what's the fastest snail? And I have, over the years, been running slug races. So the slugs are put here in the center track here, and then they have to crawl to the outside edge to, to win the race. And the fastest slug that I ever saw was Lemax Maximus. That's the leopard slug. That's the one. You can find them here in your garden sometime. And it ran that 20 centimeter track, that's an eight inch track, in one and a half minutes, 90 seconds. So that's the fastest one that I've ever seen. Um, another really fast one is the uh, rosy wolf snail. So this is um, a snail that is found in Florida. It also was introduced into Hawaii in the 1950s to try and eat the giant African snail. Um, it's a carnivorous snail, it eats other snails. Um, and the, uh, the farmers in Hawaii were not happy with the giant African snail eating their papayas and their bananas and pineapples and things like that. So they brought the rosy wolf snail, the carnivorous snail, to Hawaii to eat the giant African snail, which it didn't do. Instead, it ate all of the local Hawaiian snails. So we've got some extinctions now. But the rosy wolf snail is very fast. It's got these things that look sort of like a mustache and it's very good for smelling slime trails. And as soon as they smell a slime trail, they take off really fast. I've never actually timed them, so I don't know how fast that is. But I think the fastest snail in the world might be Biomphalaria glabrata. So this is a little freshwater snail, and it's, it's pretty flat there, you can see. And this one was sent up in the space shuttle to study, do snails grow their ear, um, ear stones? Do they grow them bigger in microgravity? So the ear stones is a balancing organ that the, that the snails use, and so there's a little rock inside of a chamber, and the, 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 the rock is resting on the bottom of the chamber, so the snail knows that way's down. Well, if the rock is too light, it's not resting hard enough, then the snail grows it bigger. So in microgravity, the rock would be floating around inside the chamber and not be very heavy. The snail would grow it bigger. So scientists put these snails up in microgravity up in the space shuttle, and in fact, they did grow their rock bigger, just as they predicted, and the snail was going 28,000 kilometers an hour around the, around the world. So I think that Biomphalaria glabrata gets the record for the fastest snail in the world.